Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about mouse move event in OSIS or Windows application. So I tell you know, the first step is we need to take uh, all three levels and one button. So I tell you know, all toolbox command. So three level. So one time I click here this second time here third time. So three levels is now at here. And hereafter, I need one button control. So, and here I am going to increase the size. So, this should be bigger. Now, hereafter, select button control and go to event or button control here we need to search mouse move event so this is a key here this is a mouse and inside mouse move uh, inside mouse you will get mouse move event so add here you have to double click and let's write code inside mouse move event so right here I'm taking integer variable or and here so this is a E so E is for message mouse event ARGS object of E so right here this is a class mouse event ARGS and E is the object so if you press E here we need to take X so x is get x coordinate that is x axis and here we need to divide this by 255 and end g so add here e dot system y axis or y coordinate dividing by 255 And here in variable b. So this I'm going to do R plus G. And uh, here dividing by Q. Now let's uh, use level one here text. So in level 1 that display red color and that concatenate the value with R and in level here text that to or display green and that concatenate the value of G. So G value is this one. And in level 3 or text that concatenate or display at your blue. And uh, here B. And hereafter I am going to take back color. So at here background color form background so that kit and set the color equal to color dot so add here from ARGB so this is about ARGB color color dot form ARGB so add here we have to pass three parameter and create color structure so this create the color structure and here let's uh, pass uh, and here ARGB a value is specified 32 bit ARGB so first we need to pass at here R G and B 
So this is the simplest called inside mouse move event or button control. So let's execute and see the output. So here if I am going to move the cursor in the form nothing changed. So if I am going to take the cursor, see color getting changed and here the text answer. So here this is a mouse move event in button. So if I out from button, so no any color getting changed. So at here this is red. Here this is denoting X axis. Here this is green. Here blue. So see at here the color changes. Red one and two. Yeah, this thing. So this is the mouse move event inside to button control. So if you are going to do the mouse move event in form control, so what we need to do at here? Copy this code and go to the form designer. Here select the form and form one that is selected. Go to the event. Here you can also get mouse move event. So here mouse move. So double click now paste that thing here. So here you can give G and here R. Now let's execute. So add here the cursor is out of form. So if you uh, take into the form so see the color getting changed here yeah. mouse move mouse if the mouse move then color get changed so this is the things about mouse move so here yeah. so if you are going to take the cursor in button so as of the color get changed so every move the event is fire every move of cursor the event fire so this is the things about mouse move, moving the color get changed and event file. So let's uh, add here. So add here I have taken integer variable r and e dot x. So x coordinate that div uh, mod 255. Yeah. So I just uh, divide that uh, things by 255 here in y also. And here b equal to r g plus r g r plus g by 2 and here or read that go to the label form and can get and with r value. So r value see if you are going to execute. So I just to take so r value is now whatever the things that go, can get in it with read and here see red and R value so R value here yeah, that change and here for level 2 that uh, can concatenate green uh, uh, print green and concatenate G value so see at here the green, uh, G value is changing and here yeah, level 3 this is uh, blue it's a uh, displaying blue and here yeah, can concatenate the B value so B value 1 to 100 now so these are the things inside to mouse move event. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So if you have any doubt related to this video, leave a comment. Definitely I will reply. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next video. Thank you.